Hey, welcome back. You know, before we say goodbye and we send you all on your way, I figured now was as good a time as any to try the new Taco Bell menu item that's the talk of social media. That's right, baby. The Mexican pizza is back and so is our Hot Topics panel. Ian, Terry, and Rebecca, all with me now and all with their very own <laughs> Mexican pizza. Now, I love this. I think that this is delicious, and I don't care what people say if it's not pizza. Uh -uh. It's the not. only thing is, I didn't remember it having tomatoes on it. Like, it's always had tomato damage. Mm -hmm. oh. I've never had it, to be honest with you. This is going to be my first time trying it. Your life's about to change. Whoa, so that, right now. <laughs> that Taco Bell sauce, too, is mm -hmm. just, maybe that's a little bit of Tex-Mex right there. <laughs> what do you think, Terry? <laughs> Yeah. Don't lie. That's different. I mean, it's, you know. <laughs> so, uh, by the way, a Mexican pizza is two layers of, it looks like a corn tortilla, mm -hmm. and refried beans, and ground beef, with uh, lots of cheese, so, and, you know. I, I have to say, when they removed this from the menu, I, w I was craving it one day, and my wife and I found a DIY recipe <laughs> online, and I we did it that. ourselves, and it was incredible. But it is nice to have this back, you know. It, I it, love it's this a good day you. when the Mexican pizza comes home. Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> Fusion is all the rage these days, right? <laughs> right. I want to eat this whole Italian. thing right now. Yeah. Bex, you know you love it. Well, I mean, it was one of my favorite ones before they took it off the menu. Um, but I do kind of wonder if the reason why it's so popular is just because people couldn't have it or because they really like it. Is that like the filet of fish with the Mickey D's? Yeah, yeah I mean. <laughs> people are like, oh, bring back that filet yeah, of fish. Yeah. No, it's a McRib. McRib. Oh, McRib, right. Right. my bad. Mm -hmm. All right, well, the <laughs> McRib. <laughs> anyway, people were really sad when this went away, so they're happy now. But speaking of sad faces, have you seen this filter on Snapchat? <laughs> it's a crying face filter. So we just tried it this morning. <laughs> no, we did not punch Ian in the gut. Ben's <laughs> <laughs> <a> filter. <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? What? Oh, my lips look like that. <laughs> and we're like actually smiling underneath these filters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the winner so far. That I is think. the winner. Yeah. The Joker. <laughs> 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 Why does this exist? I know. I saw it online and I thought it was fake at first. I was like, why are they taking pictures of people's sad face? And then I was like, okay. Good. My, my wife it. says I don't cry enough when we watch uh, movies or TV shows. So I think I'll just have her put that on me. And then she, you know, she'll she'll know I'm feeling that way when yes. we're watching. You could just fake it too. You'd be like, oh, I really got upset by Downton Abbey and just take the picture with the, the filter. That's yeah. it. Just take one and send it to her and be like, I'm having a bad day. I need a hug. And you get a hug when you get home. Yeah. I mean, these filters are getting really, no. really good. I took one on the other day that made me look like a whole different person. Yeah, like, I, just my nose was like, it was just crazy. I'm having trouble just getting used to my <laughs> own normal face. Just leave my face alone. We can actually never see that picture again. <laughs> that, How do they do this? That should be like your your social media profile picture from yeah. now on. New Amity headshots. shows her true emotions. <laughs> deep That's why she's deep so emotions great. with Amity. Uh, it gives another meaning to that ugly cry face that nobody wants to see. <laughs> that is truly ugly cry face. What are some of the other filters that y'all have seen on social media that you just can't get enough of? I mean the cat ones, right? Oh, the cat Those ones are, the are best great. Ones. Yeah. yeah. I've never done the cat one. You get no, little cat ears. The cat. Never done the cat. Uh, with yeah, the, the with your daughters? Ones? I've seen them do it. I just have never done it. I'm not. I don't. I guess I'm not a filter guy so much. Yeah. Oh. I mean, I, maybe I need to try some. Maybe okay. that'll improve my social media presence. Step outside your comfort. Zone. Well, <laughs> Terry, I don't know where I put my phone today, but before <laughs> you leave the studio. We are putting cat ears on you. Oh, great. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you all so much for joining me today. This has been so much fun. I have had so many belly laughs. And thanks to you out there for spending time with us today. I hope you had some belly laughs as well. You can check our website always for more content. You can always send us an email and share your thoughts. Go out there and enjoy your new day. We'll see you next time.